Hey guys, this is Michael and if you guys are also interested in knowing if there are any performance differences um, between the iOS 7 and iOS 8 on the iPad Air, then this is the video you want to, to watch. So what I'm doing right now is basically I, I just freshly booted my iPad Air. It's still got the iOS 7 at this stage. So what we're gonna do is just I mean we know the performance is good. I mean you guys when you watch this you probably own an iPad by yourself. So you know this is all fairly quick. The booting time was 25 seconds. I stopped it. So let's see if this will will change. Alright, so here we got some things to open if we bring this so this is everything pretty quick everything works very well so just for you guys again impression now let's swipe what's it doing here okay this is probably nothing is loaded okay it looks very quick as usual very smooth get up it comes very quick it's very fast okay just the way we know it perfectly smooth all right um, okay I'm gonna upgrade now and then we see if there are any differences any performance of these kind of swiping activities Okay, so here it's coming up again. Just to um, to say again, this is the iPad Air, 32 gig. It's the Wi-Fi only version. And um, let's see now. I've upgraded to iOS 8. So I stopped the um, booting time, and it's actually exactly the same. It's also 25 seconds, so there's no difference at all. All right, so let's take a look. Um, first of all, settings, general software update. You see it's iOS 8. And I didn't show this in my last video, but I also, ah, okay, sorry. I also, um, I had everything. There was no tab in here. It was all empty. So that memory is completely empty. And we have the exact same condition. So this time again, everything is empty. I'm going to start the same sort of apps. Actually, my impression is first of all that it's exactly the same speed, if if not faster. So some apps appear even to start faster. Um, Safari. Okay, and then we had the. The maps and especially the maps look at this it's much faster yeah I mean seriously that's good so very smooth this works very smooth so there's no lag whatsoever everything works very well um, yeah as you saw the maps it's even loading quicker let's go to settings again I'll do this very quick so I can definitely recommend the upgrade to iOS 8 if you're the owner of an iPad Air because there's no lag, it's quick, it's it's perfect. I mean Apple did a good job this time. Excellent. Okay, that is it. Thanks for watching. I hope this video was helpful and I see you in the next video. Thanks guys, bye bye.